Hello there. Is somebody there? Oh! Are you kidding me? Nasty. Nasty, nasty, nasty. Hi, guys. <laughs> Welcome uh, to another indie horror game playthrough. We are going to be playing Incident at Grove Lake. You can find all the links in the description. Let's jump into it. Made with Unity. We love a Unity game. This game contains flashing images which may potentially trigger seizures for people with photosensitive epilepsy. Oh, I didn't read the bottom half. Intended to be played in one sitting. Headphones recommended. I'm terrified! Um, I think this is an alien game. It is a pay-as-you'd-like game on itch.io. So make sure to go ahead and check it out. Um, created by Dan McGrath. Thank you, Dan. I'm excited. This has a lot of really good, uh, really good, um, reviews. And I've heard a lot of really good feedback, so I'm excited. Repent of your sins and turn to God, for the kingdom of heaven is near. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Move the mouse out of the way. No trespassing beyond this point. Restricted area. This looks like Area 51 to me. This looks very much like, uh, Area 51. Wasn't there supposed to be a big meetup at Area 51 a couple years ago? Like, everyone was like, they can't stop us all. <laughs> Which is wild. Wild. <laughs> Not as wild as, like, January 6th, but... <laughs> Let's go to a government facility because they can't stop us all. Like, what are you doing? Um, okay, there's a car leaving on September 6th, 1997, around 4.30 at the front gate don't know if that's pertinent i don't know i don't know what i need to be paying attention to in this game i already like the art style though this is one of my favorite art styles for horror initializing scan Ooh. work don't worry i have my inhaler with me guys host client reached triangulating target position connecting to live footage connecting to live audio Okay, work. Oh, what is that noise? Oh, nostalgia. <laughs> I can drop it. <laughs> Accessing audio. Okay. Click to begin. Target. Appreciate you taking my call. Let's get this straight. You got out unnoticed? Medical discharge. They think I have kidney stones. <laughs> Not so smart as they think at S4, huh? What is S4? Smarter than you know. So come to the meet. Sure, let's make it a public place. Remember, I don't have a lot of time. Neither do I. Let's say the diner on redacted. Works for me. I'll bring what I found. Why is it redacted? For me. Good, I'll see you soon. Remember what I have risked for this. I remember. Sorry, I just, I just woke up like two minutes ago. I have to dog sit today, so I was like, let me get some recording in so I can edit. Get something up soon. Somewhere north of Nevada. I knew it was Area 51. Area 51's in Nevada, right? <laughs> I said that with such confidence. No, I'm not so sure. Oh, work. I know we're obviously supposed to go this. Oh, I'm sorry. That scared me. Thought it was clipping. I can't run. I, it's uh, it's definitely walking simulator vibes. Let's just walk. See what happens. I'm... Oh, I love this art style. I haven't been able to play games like this in so long, guys. I'm so glad I hopped back on here. Why are they... Do you see this van? This parked the opposite way. It's weird. Is it just me or is that weird? That's strange. This one is too. Why are some of these cars parked, like, opposite? Like they were driving, oh, there's a diner. Hello. Hello. Nothing better than walking into like a nice, a nice little like 50s-esque, this isn't 50s-esque, but in general, a 50s-esque diner out of the rain, feeling like I'm in like a movie. You look like, yeah, I was gonna say, you look like the one I have to talk to. I was getting vibes, you would sit in the corner so no one could hear us. Thank you for, for coming. I didn't know who else to tell. I've risked so much getting here. They're following me. Are you making fun of my stutter? I don't have much time. But please take these. These files and just one of many tapes they have. Why was tapes capitalized? This, uh, get the stuff to the public. They need to know, but before, it's too late. 
If I don't hear from you by the 11th, I'm going public with this. There's a radio station I know of, you know. Please go and be careful. They'll follow you too. The radio station. Pick up tape and files or whoever's following you will follow me as well. Okay. If I ever made a game, it would be a game in this style. I really wanted to do video game design for a while. Actually, I changed my major to align with it at one point in college. It just didn't work out. Um, but if I ever had the freedom, I would love to make a game. Okay, we're clearly investigating like the guy from <laughs> like the guy from that Philadelphia show. I can't I can't remember the name right now. I'm so embarrassed. I should. I live like what three hours from Philadelphia. Let me turn my audio up a little bit. Um. Tell you about something that happened in uh, about 1977, 1978. First, doesn't sound important. I think it's just general radio chatter. Uh, look at documents. Okay, we see UFO shapes. Is my guess. Um, UFO in the sky. Oh, terrifying. <laughs> ah! <laughs> <laughs> Jump scare. Um, okay, let's go ahead and throw in this tape. I think what's on the tape is what's important. Okay. I'm standing back. Are we going to be controlling what we see in the tape? If so, I, I love that. The following tape is property of the United States government. Incident number seven. Example of encounter type F. What does that mean? Copying or distribution of this tape is strictly prohibited. Classification of this content is reserved. Blah, 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 blah. I missed it. Sorry. The following took place August 19th to the 21st in 1997, Grove Lake. So this is, again, I can't read that fast. Please contact your facility for blah, 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 blah. blah. Paragraph eight for a psychoanalysis and debrief. <laughs> you guys can pause and read if it's that important. If they made the text go that fast, it makes me think it's not that important. Oh, yes, I love, I love when you get to control like a video, like a video that you're watching in a game, like Resident Evil 7, how they would give you the tapes and you could watch Mia. Oh, love it. Play SP and the time in the corner. We're going for it. I can't run. So this is this is as fast as I can go. I love the colors in this, the palette. It's giving it's giving dusk a uh, firewatch. I could live in a game like this. Oh you see that? Is everything slanting? Or is that me? <laughs> Am I just a little bit lopsided? It is. It, the camera keeps shifting so that everything's like slanted one way. Sorry, I keep checking behind me. I'm not trying. I'm not trying to scare myself. I just kind of am. I hear a. I hear a fly. A little bit. I hear a little bit of a fly. Oh, Jesus! Why would you do that? Oh. Okay. I'm clicking. Okay. <coughs> okay. I should have looked at that scene more. I kind of disassociated, I'm going to be honest. Um, I think I was sitting by a fire. The lake is that way. Okay, well, we're going the right way. Oh, I thought I saw something. Hello there. Is somebody there? Oh! Are you kidding me? Nasty. Nasty, nasty, nasty. I hate... On the edge of the screen, do you see that? The pixelation pixelization that's like dragged out I hate that it's throwing me off it's like making me my right eye feel like something's wrong it sounds like they're talking about aliens it was an aircraft or something it's a little bit too mumble jumbled for me to uh, sit down and want to understand what they're saying but it's fine. Do you guys like my uh, my audio and microphone upgrades, by the way? By the way, by the way. I finally took the time to figure out my lighting, and now I don't look red. Because in the videos last week, I looked red. I, th I felt like I did. I don't know. Maybe I'm hypercritical. And I didn't turn on the AC today, guys, so you can hear everything I'm saying. It doesn't sound like a buzz. God. <laughs> I work so hard. <laughs> Oh, no, uh, can you stop doing that? It's just really loud in my headphones. <sighs> oh, mouse out of the way. 
please turn supplied handbook to page 42. We will now review the four types of encounters, okay? Have you guys ever seen Fourth Kind? Loved it. Let me know what you thought about it. One of my absolute favorite uh, alien movies. Okay, the first kind, CE1. Visual sightings of an unidentified flying object seemingly less than 500 feet away that show an appreciable angular extension in considerable detail. Okay. I feel like we've all had a sight one encounter. Um, second kind. Is that why it's called the fourth kind, the movie? Like it's the fourth kind of encounter? I don't remember the plot as much, but that that makes sense. A UFO event with physical effect, such as an interference, animal re reactions, or physical trace like impressions in the ground, scorched or otherwise affected vegetation, or a chemical trace. The third kind, CE3, is a UFO encounter in which an animated entity is president. Stop. These Look at that. That's so creepy. These include humanoids, robots, and humans who seem to be occupants or pilots of a UFO. Pilots. Pilots of a UFO. Uh, the fourth kind is a close encounter of the fourth kind is a UFO event in which a human is abducted by a UFO or its occupants. No idea that's why. I, may, I might have known that when the movie came out when it was more relevant. A C2. Please identify on your workbook any further encounter types. Blah, blah, blah. So it's a C2 at least is what I'm getting. Maybe it starts as a C2 and then it, it trips over. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh. Somehow our vision got a lot better. <laughs> this camera just upgraded overnight from a, a like little handbox. Oh. From a little handbox camera to like a an iPhone 13 Max. <laughs> we love it. Okay, that's wild. Oh, wow. Okay, stop. No. I think that would freak me out. One, no. Like, I, I think people get shooting stars mixed up with UFOs all the time. But, oh, okay, that's it. That would be it for me. That would be it. I'd clock out. Take me out back and put me down. <laughs> I would disassociate and never recover. Okay, we're back at the campfire. Why did we stay overnight? Why are we here? I didn't realize it was our campfire. There's only one way to go, even though la earlier there was two ways. Although we might have moved our campfire. I mean, after seeing that... Did you hear that? Oh my god. He sounds like me after a flight of stairs. I see our camp still back there. What is that? Oh my god. I'm gonna keep going. I feel like I should stand still. Stop. This is a sighting of the second kind? Oh my god. <laughs> this is wild. This music the music got me, gal. <laughs> The music got me, gal. Okay. A barn. Great. Why are barns heavily associated with aliens? Oh my god. Okay, well, I, know, I now know why you had the strobe alert. He left the camera, and he's just having a moment. Me in the woods at 3 a.m. This is literally a video of me. Oh, not anymore. That hasn't happened to me. <laughs> the panic attack in the woods, me. The being abducted, not me. Oh, so there's two cameras, or? I, I, don't know. I don't think it has to be that technical. Suspension of disbelief. Oh my god. Why is it like. Why does it look like. Oh, okay, it's like a forest, but why? Why would there be like a forest growing inside of it? Ooh, ew, it's. Listen to that. Slimy. It's slimy. Oh my god. Alright. <laughs> not my circus, not my monkeys. <laughs> None of my business. Didn't see that. Um Okay. Again, I don't see anything. <laughs> just going on a stroll. <laughs> Nighttime stroll, nothing's happening. Oh, oh, just kidding. Didn't look at it. Oh my god. What do you think this is? You think these are tendrils? It was giving tree at first. I'm not going to go out of my way to go look at you. It was giving tree at first, but now it's kind of giving, like, um, intestines and tendrils and... 
I haven't said Squid Game. I don't know why I keep talking about Squid Game in my life. I haven't talked about Squid Game in a year and a half, and it's come up so many times the last week. To sign, I need to sign into Roblox and play some Squid Game. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is too much. This is an experience. <laughs> me last night me after two long islands <laughs> oh my god threw myself into an asthma fit i think i need that first inhaler hit of the day So good. The tape is now concluded. No further footage was recoverable. Tape will blah blah blah. Please now contact your facility supervisor for psychoanalyst and debrief. We will be signing and completing form 52 up. <laughs> your discretion is a matter of national security. Please remember your oath and those who came before you. Please eject tape now. Gladly, I'm done. Okay, that was loud. I'm gonna be deaf by the time I'm done recording these games. Oh, who's this? Is this like our high-rise apartment? Look at us! I've always wanted to live in a high-rise. But I also hate the idea about being surrounded by neighbors. Can I just live in a house on stilts? <laughs> Can I just Can I shoot my house on stilts? Really, really long stilts? Okay. Hide. Can I hide? No, hide. Why would you not? You're an idiot. You want me to answer the door? Alright, let's do it. Ooh! Oh, it's just the FBI. <laughs> oh, it's just the FBI. <laughs> Go ahead, shoot me. I dare you. Oh, well. Oops. I didn't, I didn't mean it. <laughs> I didn't mean it. Oh my god. He got his pew pew out. On September 11th, 1997, talk show host Art Bell receives a friend. Oh. Online, you're on the air. Hello. Hello, Art. Yes. Hi. Um, I, 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 I don't have a whole lot of uh, time. Um, oh, well, look, let's begin yeah. by finding out whether you're using this line properly beginning. or not. Uh, area, area 51. Yeah, um, that's right. Were you an employee or are you now? Uh, I, a former employee. Former um, employee. I, I, I was let go on a medical discharge about a week ago, and and <laughs> I, I, I've kind of been running a, across the country. Um, oh man, I don't know where to start. They're uh, they're they're gonna um, they'll triangulate on this position really really soon. So um, you can't spend a lot of time on the phone. So give us something quick. Okay. Um. Um. Okay, what well, what we're thinking of as as aliens are they're uh, they're they're extra dimensional beings that an earlier precursor of the um, space program made contact with uh, they they are not what they claim to be uh, they have infiltrated a lot of uh, uh, a lot of aspects of of, of the military establishment, particularly the Area 51, uh, the, the disasters that are coming, they, the, the military, I'm sorry, the, the government knows about them, and there's a lot of safe areas in this world that they could begin moving the population to now are but they're not doing, they're not doing anything. They are not, they want the major population centers wiped out so that the 
The few that are left will be more easily controllable. Discharge. <laughs> that movie called The Happening. It's a lot like that. I, I, I started getting... Excuse me. Connection lost. Created by Dan McGrath. Go Dan. Dan, that was an experience. I had a lot of fun. I... I'm going to follow you. I'm going to make sure I follow you so I can see if you make anything else in the future or if you've made anything else. I might um I might give it a try. It was a lot of fun, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. A little little indie horror moment. That was funny. It kind of scared my it scared me off my heebie-jeebies. It's this spoopy. Um yeah. That was that was a good time. Cool. So, make sure to check out the game in the link below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, all that crazy stuff. Um, and then I'll have a video on screen right now if you've made it this far um, a suggested video if you haven't seen it uh, I played backrooms recently it's live and it is uh, gives the same vibes as this I won't spoil it but it's a, it's called the complex on footage so if you need another video or something else to watch go ahead and head on over there other than that thank you guys so much for watching um, and have a wonderful day <laughs> have a good day um, all right Bye, guys.